Welcome to the Digital Fox and in this video what I want to show you is how you can install WordPress with just one click. It's really very cool and uh, I've actually installed hundreds and hundreds of WordPress websites and had to do it manually and it takes anywhere from five to ten minutes depending on the server and how fast it is and you know, setting up, downloading the files, logging into the FTP and creating the account, uploading the files, creating the database, entering in all the files and information. It really just took a long time and I'm, and I'm really excited that they came out with this. I don't have to manually install WordPress anymore. Thank goodness because it took so long, but I, now I can do it with just one click and, and the good news is now it, it's only going to take you uh, one second or two seconds to go through the process to install WordPress. It, it doesn't do anything different. It just sets it all up for you and goes uh, and does the manual process for you automatically, which is great. So we're going to scroll all the way down here once we've logged into the cPanel of our HostGator account. And it's right here. It says quick install. And as you can see, there's actually a lot of different options of, of software that we can install. We can install a PHP uh, BB, uh, which is a, a bulletin board, uh, BB Press, which is the one that I like. Um, you, can, you can also use Joomla and a couple of other different content management software uh, as well. So the one that we actually want to use right here is WordPress and this is state of the art they actually keep it up to date so you're going to get the most up to date version of wordpress and we want to find our domain name which is right there which is wordpress uh, wordpress webmasteracademy.com um, and then we don't want to add it to anywhere else we don't want to add it to a, um, a subdomain or anything like that so the admin let's go ahead and type that in and the blog name is going to be uh, wordpress uh, Webmaster Academy okay so click install um, it's downloading the app and everything and it's gonna go through the process of actually installing it um, and as I'm sitting here just kinda hanging out um, I could check my email or update my Facebook status or go over to Twitter um, and do it real quick and as you can see congratulations we are done so now we're basically installed and ready to go. Um, that's how long it took to install WordPress um, onto our site. So now the next step, if you haven't done this already, we're going to have to go uh, back over to GoDaddy or to your domain registrar and enter in our, our name servers. Now the, what that is, is that's basically your, you have your domain name over in one area and you have your hosting over in another area. So when somebody types in your domain name, it needs to know exactly where to go and the way that it, it knows that is by your name servers. It's basically your address for your hosting. So your domain name is your, let's say your, your, your post office, like your city post office box. And then it, it goes there and then they look at your address and they forward it over to your hosting account. So it shows up underneath your domain name. So go ahead and check out the next video on how to do a domain transfer. It's, it's actually simple and easy to do, especially with GoDaddy. Um, so I'm going to take you through that process. If you have any questions or comments or, or if you're having any difficult with installing WordPress, which it's actually really simple to do, uh, use the comment box down below if you have any problems um, going through that. Um, uh, that that this process right here and I promise I'll get back with you to help you out and of course if I'm online there's a live chat box down in the corner you can click on that and I can I can help you instantly as well so thank you guys very much for visiting me here on this uh, this step of installing WordPress with one click and I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video